What's up guys, Lego Bros Reviews here, and today we are going to take a look at the Dragon Dance Guy Brickhead. This is set number 40354, it consists of 170 pieces, and it retails for $9.99. It was released in 2019, and it is a Lego exclusive. However, this set is still available, so you can get yourself one if you want to. Um, and this is one of the Lego sets that will be retiring at the end of 2020. So obviously if you've been wanting this set or thinking about getting it, I highly recommend getting it soon because of COVID-19 and the Mexico factory being closed and stock having to be um, split between Europe and the United States and Canada. I just don't know as far as production and stock how sets will look towards the end of the year. So like I said before, highly recommend getting it as soon as possible if you are interested in getting this set and i will be putting out a video in the next week or so of all the lego sets retiring in the year 2020 so you know if you've wanted one of the sets on those on the list that you should probably get it soon so anyway let's go ahead and take a look at the dragon dance sky brickhead and we don't have just one of these or two of these we have three of these dragon dance sky brickheads and the whole reason why we have three is because me and my brother both wanted one and we didn't know our mom had already bought one. So we ended up with three, but this might just be my favorite brick head of all time. So I'm fine with having three. Um, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the brick head now and all the detail in this set. So let's go ahead and start with the front here. You can see the detail of the dragon um, the dragon costume, the head part, all the detail on the dragon, the eyes, the horns, the teeth. It just looks amazing. It's just a polished model. Um, and then those gold, um, the gold detail on the shirt as well is really great. Another thing I love about this set is it has the two lantern side builds, which really add to this set sitting on top of those maroon platforms. And as I've said in some of the previous Brickhead videos, Lego discontinued the printed brick for Brickheads, saying like what series it was from or like if it was a seasonal set. So we don't get that uh, in this Brickhead, but that's fine. Um, and we'll look at the platform in a little bit. So let's just look at the side now. So on the side here, you can see the detail of the scales. And I love the uh, yellow and red coloring that they used for this set. You can see they have the hair in black there as well as you can see the side of the eyes and like the back of the eyelash there and you can get a better view of the lantern now if we take a look at the back we can see the tail of the dragon the back of the eyes and um those like scales or spikes on the tails which once again in those gold pieces it looks amazing if we flip it to our last side uh it's really similar to the other side it, in fact it's the exact same but the detail and the colors just make this set amazing. So now let's go ahead and take the brick head off of the platform, move it aside so we can get a better look. So on the platform here, you just have those two, the brick with the two studs on either side for this brick head to stand on. And it's a nice little display, especially with those side builds on the bottom. And I don't know if Lego did this on purpose, um, might be a little easter egg that i just noticed but if you look at the brick head here um or on most brick heads you can see this lines up with it the face you got your flat and then your uh one with two studs on the end for the eyes and then it would have a two by four uh tile up there um i'll have to check some of the other platforms and let you guys know but that's something i just barely noticed and if that's like a little easter egg or something done on purpose to resemble the face of a brick head. That is pretty cool. So I think that's all for this uh, Dragon Dance Guy brick head review. And our next uh, brick head review is going to be the Lucky Cat brick head, which is another Chinese themed brick head. And if you enjoyed this video or found it useful in any way, don't forget to give it a like. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. And like I said in one of my other videos, over 90% of our viewers are not subscribed. And you want to subscribe so that you can stay on top of our latest LEGO news because we're going to have tons of useful guides and whatnot coming out in the next few weeks. 
Um, you want to be on top of the latest Lego news, so you know, like, what sets to get, what sets are retiring, and all that stuff. And you don't want to miss out on our latest Lego reviews, because the Lego Mario sets, um, we're going to be doing more reviews on those, as well as a couple other sets, and you don't want to miss out on those. So don't forget to subscribe. And, um, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.